I commit to provide mothers of newborn babies with diapers for their children for a minimum of three months paid for by the government of Kenya. Tumekubaliana Moranga County. Tumewapatia bilioni moja na laki moja ya stima ya watu wa Moranga County. Neguo. Sasa hiyo stima mimi nimekuja hapa mahali inaitwa Marewa hapa chini. Nyinyi mnaelewa hapo chini hapo? Nimekuja kuanzisha hiyo maneno hapo. Hiyo Marewa hapo kwa kijiji. Nani anatoka Marewa hapa? Eh sasa nyinyi stima mimi nimesema watu karibu hamsini wawekewe stima bila ya kulipa pesa yoyote. Nekuo. Kila mtu tumwekee stima. Ladies and gentlemen, listening to William Samaruto, one would think that is a president who can perform uh, economic miracles. Listening to many speeches, especially about development, what one would think he can outperform any president in Africa. Listening to William Samoruto, one would think that he can easily turn Kenya into Singapore of Africa. But two years down the line, almost halfway into his first term, there's nothing to show. If you listen to what he's saying here about paying taxes and though you are not going to borrow money, you see a person who speaks with both sides of the mouth. When you look at William Samoruto, William Samoruto is very good at using gestures. Most of the time when he starts talking, he uses the left hand and then after some time he reverts to the, the right hand. And he uses so many gestures. Uh, and um, maybe this is uh, to actually uh, make his point clear. But again, he is also known to bite the lips when he's talking. If you look at our country today and you compare the reality on the ground and what William Samoruto has been saying, you see a total contradiction total contradiction he says that nobody is going to steal our money kenyans has faithfully been paying taxes we have been paying taxes but if you ask William Samoruto today how much money kenyans have contributed through the affordable housing tax he cannot account for it if you ask William Samoruto how much money has been spent in the construction of these affordable houses? He cannot account for it. If you ask William Samoruto where the money has gone, the money we has been borrowing. Yes, yes, remember, he tells us that we are not going to borrow, but he goes ahead and borrow a lot of money. If you ask him where or what our money has done, you realize that we have not gotten the value of the loans that we are paying. Today, the government is lamenting about debts. But surprisingly, William Samoruto is telling us that he's not, he's not going to go for more debts. But he's going for more debts. That is why uh, he is moving from one country uh, to the other, looking for debts, looking for deals. If you look at there are so many scandals that have happened in this country since he became the president of the Republic of Kenya. You realize that we cannot be able to fight corruption. You know, Waswahili wanasema, Sikujema wanekana subuhi. If you look at William Samoruto and you compare him to somebody like Mwaki Bake, Mwaki Bake was very much focused. Remember, Mwaki Bake became the president of the Republic of Kenya. He was sworn in in December 2022. No, 2002. 
And by January, I think January 8, January 10, he had given free education. If you look at what Kibake did, Kibake knew what this country needed. But when you look at William Samoruto, William Samoruto seemed not to understand what our country needs. Kenyans are interested with good roads. How many kilometers has William Samoruto constructed? Kenyans are interested with free education. What has William Samoruto's government done to our education? Kenyans are crying are lamenting about the high cost of school fees in high schools, the high cost of uh, fees in university, name it. And even in public schools, education is not free. Ask any person who is in this school whether education is free. I'll be shocked to hear they pay a lot of money. Ladies and gentlemen, the remaining two years of William Samoruto, we cannot expect much. Let us not expect much. For those of us who expected free Wi-Fi around marketplaces everywhere, najua utakuwa kipiga simu, utakuwa kitumia bundles, that's what he promised Kenyans. You better forget this, because if you put a lot of expectations in somebody, and he does not fulfill the expectations you'll be disappointed for those of us who have been waiting for william samoruto to manage the economy such that he can bring even the cost of electricity down it is not going to happen life gonna be worse under william samoruto i was expecting that they are going to lower the fuel prices yesterday but they didn't, they didn't. Things remained the same. If I may ask you a question, a simple question. When was life better? Ada, is it Ada Uhuru Kenyatta or Ada William Samoruto? Because you see, many people trying to talk about the issue of Uga's G. He has managed to bring the cost of Uga from Kenya Shilling 200, Kenya Shilling 200 to Kenya Shilling 100. It, it is not William Samoruto. Who has brought the price down? We have had enough rains. The weather has been very, very conducive. We have had a bumper harvest. Not because of the fertilizer. In fact, this fertilizer, I even understand it was given free. It was supposed to be given free. Yet farmers, they were not supposed to buy anything. Because it was actually a donation from Russia. So let's uh, uh, not expect too much from William Samoruto. We will keep at the chakula. Shukur mugu. Soga bele na maisha. Lakini, if you are expecting that William Samoruto is going to make use of our taxes, you better forget. If you are expecting that William Samoruto is going to ensure that our systems are running, sahau kabisa. I was going through the manifesto of UDA and was shocked that nothing has been achieved and we don't expect anything. Read this. This is your president.